Hi, I'm David. Hi, I'm Ashley. We're Ryan's parents. And this is Ryan's story. We originally did not know that Ryan had Down syndrome and we went through a a few pediatricians before they actually came to us and told us, hey, like we think he has Down syndrome and we're like, yeah, we kind of figured. (laughs) Um, So then, um, you know, they went and did testing, checked his heart. You know, we did find out at that point that he had a cardiac condition. And then um, we're getting ready to leave. It was 2 a.m. We wanted to go home. And we get in the car and I'm sitting in the front seat and we're making our way home. And he states, we get to do Special Olympics and just start getting all excited about like the things that we get to do with him. At the Children's Center, they were absolutely phenomenal. Mm -hmm. They took so much stress away. We didn't have to worry about where we were staying, trying to figure out where to even eat. Like they were just, I was blown away with the care and compassion of the nurses, the doctors. I mean, very personable. Um, His surgeon directly reached out to us and had conversations with us when we almost had to postpone. Um, She was absolutely phenomenal. They kind of set us up across the street, but it still felt like we were in the room, uh, at least me personally. The Down syndrome diagnosis and the um, cardiac diagnosis changed our family in a lot of different ways. For us, it was, you know, the stress of having a child who needed open heart surgery. Um, And also, you know, there was a little stress in the beginning with him having Down syndrome with um, my older sister, Shannon, having Down syndrome. It did make it a little easier to accept and work with that diagnosis. For the future, as Ryan gets older, I feel that Shannon's going to be a huge role model to Ryan. He will have that person that really understands what he's feeling because she's lived it. And it's it's almost like they 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 have like a like a sixth sense, you know. Mm. Picks them up here and there, just at a random, you know. We'll we'll look over and and Aunt Shannon's got Ryan. And it's like, oh, okay, I guess I guess they wanted some time together, you know. She wanted to give him a hug, but it's it's beautiful. I love it. I've never in my life have looked at an individual with Down syndrome and and thought less or different. They're just like you and I. Individuals with Down syndrome, no matter what the circumstance, no matter what they're doing, what they're going through, what they face, the challenges that they may or may not have, they smile more than anybody I've ever seen. They have so much fun with any situation. And, And I know you think the same thing. Absolutely, absolutely. It's something that you don't need to be afraid of for um, for a parent that has just found out that their child has Down syndrome. From one mom to another, it is not the end of the world. You have a whole lifetime of love and compassion from your child and it it's just an amazing experience yeah. that you are just, it's gonna blow your mind. It's just so fun just watching him explore and learn. You kind of look at other kids and you watch them learn. And when you're looking at Ryan learn, it's it's not even like he's learning. It's like he's just having fun, Mm -hmm. you know? We could probably go on for hours about him. He's just, he's a character.